Welcome back in TechDev Studio and in this video I'm going to show you how to make the offset system. So the offset system is pretty useful. It will make your game more you know like believable and also you know it's not looking and no good stuff. Okay so currently you can see our camera we can move up to town but you can see the character is not you know it's the weapon is not moving around like how we want. Okay so let's fix this thing. So for fixing this thing first, at here, we need couple of animation. Uh, in the animation sector, it will depends on you which type of animation you have. But in my case, we need the offset system. Okay. So here is the offset example. So we need a, you know, the CC which is center, then center down, left, left down, left up, right, right down, right up, and central up okay we need cover of this animation once you have this animation you need to create a blend space basically so you can go to the animation then choose here the blend space and here now you need to choose your character uh, skeleton basically uh, yeah so in the skeleton in my case that is uh, the human one so I'm going to search in my one is ask a human let's give that RF uh, offset BL which is basically present in blend space now double click and open once you open you will be find something like this so at here what we need to do first we need to make it a limitation about uh, how much further it can be go also uh, let's open our animation blueprint so this is our animation blueprint basically and we need to connect the offset animation uh, blend space with our animation uh, BP and make sure there we need to also set up some blueprint which is basically determine how it's going to behave when we are aiming up and down okay so keep in mind uh, we need couple of uh, blueprints as well the main issue most of cases you face with set up in the blend space basically sometimes you'll see that the animation doesn't uh, you know working at here because uh, some of cases what you do is or even if you are using any old pack so what there happen is basically like some of asset pack is already retargeted so for fixing that you need to go to the asset animation then bulk edit matrix and here you find that call active settings so here set it to non-active and then process none and base animation process none so whenever if you give, give everything is none so it will be going to be work properly and 100 percent accurate okay now we have this thing so let's open this thing okay now we need to make it uh, like how it's going to behave so if you go up to down so this is basically this is left to right so the first one is basically left to right so let's give it left to right and then we'll be said to determine level is minus 92 plus 90 and then we'll be set the grid of two and then at here we'll give it up to down so you give up dw and then at here we are again going to put the same value which is basically 90 degree plus 90 degree okay and we'll be going to set two and now we'll find something like this make sure unreal engine by default doesn't give now the snap target so you can enable the snap target system and once you have the snap target system you can enable this bar so it's going to be uh, give you the animation name so now let's bring our one more uh, content browser and now let me just set up in my left side and at here let me just pick up my offset animation let's start with the central one so this is the central then we need to give the central down and then we need to give central up something like that then we need to give the left and make sure this is full left okay and then left down and left up now you have a question why your weapon is behaving something like that if you're seeing uh, if you see carefully it's basically the rifle animation it's, uh, but in, uh, in the hand it's basically in a pistol that's why okay then we need to do the same process for right right down and right up so this is the whole animation set now whenever you now right will be see or you try to run it you will be see a smooth blending stuff okay now click on save now go to your animation blueprint now at here we need a code for calculating the how it's going to behave the aim rotation so from the velocity you can search that uh, gate or you can, even you can search from your gate on on owner gate aim 
base rotation so this is basically give you a rotation value click on split and now at here from the pitch you can multiply with uh, minus one okay and then this is basically offset value so now just promote a variable with offset okay now just simply connect with your regular base uh, animation uh, as this variable make sure uh, it's always continuous running now compile and save now go to your animation blend sector and at the last of post like why it's basically going to be blend okay now you need to make here the offset or you need to connect it okay so for connect let's give it that offset blend and now you will be see that uh, it doesn't have any type of like uh, input stuff like you'll be see only it's have a output it doesn't have any input now I have a question how we can basically merge it okay so make sure the blend spaces doesn't work directly with the one you need to basically make it a layer so now let's make a layer uh, blend post so and you find basically layer blend per bone so this is basically a blueprint which basically allow you to use multiple animation okay so this is basically our layer pose where we want to uh, blend from so in my case i'm going to blend it from spine uh, zero 01 so i'm basically copying it something like that and pasting it here then you can give the depth field i'm going to put it four and you can give the mesh space space uh, rotation then uh, at here you can basically simply connect something like this and now you need to simply connect something like that okay now we have this thing that uh, uh, the basically left right and up and down so I'm going to just keep that on the offset of up down now compile and save okay and now once we have this now let's try to let me show you add this speech is basically by default working so I'm com compiling as well make sure so as you can see it's now working perfectly like we can watch up and down and my offset is working the left one is working with that so if you have that separate one so you can use the z axis value for making the left and right one okay so yeah i hope you understand how i may i need to make the offset system so thank you so much for watching see you in the next video